Hi again, YouTubers. So this is a review of the Coastal Sense Camo Quad, and I have this in medium, and there's four colors there. There's a white, there's a light tone, I'd say a, a medium tone, and then a dark tone. And now the strange thing, first thing I'm going to point out about this is that these colors look darker here than when you swatch them except for the white the white looks like white um, i'll swatch them on my hand for you so you can see the different colors of them um, i have really 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 been liking this for under my eyes strangely enough um, i thought it was totally going to be cakey and i thought it was going to be um not enough of like a peach tone to it but it's really been working so these are the four colors there's a white this is the light colored one um, the medium and then the dark now this one's a little bit orange um, undertoned I think um, the ones I've been using the most are the light and the medium um, sometimes I mix them together like sticking my finger on each one for under my eyes sometimes I'm just using the medium uh, which is this one over here so let's whoa got it <laughs> Got it on the side of my hand. All right, let's try this again <laughs> to show you what they look like in the palette and then what they look like. I guess they are more true than I thought they were. I guess it's just this one that turns out way, way lighter than what it is. Um, and the darkest one definitely looks more orange uh, on your skin than uh, what it does in the palette. So I've been using this a lot lately. Now, the white... You can, technically what you can use white for is before you put foundation on, you can put it on the high planes of your face and it's supposed to help bring those out more. Um, and same thing, now I have you, I, I only tried that once with the white one, it didn't make enough difference to bother doing it again. The dark one I have used before, I don't have it on today, but I've used it in the hollows of my cheeks. Um, I tried it once before foundation and once after foundation. Um, I like it both ways. It's just before foundation, uh, depending on what foundation and how much coverage it is, it's sometimes you can't see it. Um, so that's why then I tried it afterwards. And Goss Makeup Artist um, is the person who he has done some videos on how to do that if you're interested. Um, but overall, what I've been using it for is the medium one and under my eyes. And if you guys follow me, I definitely... I worry about my under eyes, meaning I worry that things, a lot of my reviews, if you see me talk about concealers and things like that under my eyes, I'll tell you things get cakey or I notice it creasing through the day and things like that. And I really haven't been finding that with this, which I really am impressed with that because I thought for sure just by the consistency of it, I thought by feeling it, I was going to have a caking problem. But it's actually very, very smooth and it doesn't take much of this product at all. So that's really cool because then you can go through this thing. Um, It'll take a long while to go through this entire thing. Um, now, the other side of that is, is more than likely, I'm going to use this one up way, way before any of the others. So I would actually repurchase and still have the other portions left. Mm, it's a give and a take. I guess that happens with any type of quads. Uh, sometimes you use one color more than another. So um, I definitely like the consistency. I like the product. I like that it is increasing under my eyes. And I've also used this for blemishes. And I didn't find it to be too heavy or too oily or anything. And it didn't cause additional breakouts either, which is nice. Because sometimes I find with concealers, if I put concealer on a blemish, Sometimes um, it actually makes the blemish worse, um, and that hasn't been happening with this, so that's pretty cool. Um, I definitely think it's it's a great product. Coastal Scents um, came out with, I think there's four of them. There's a light, a medium, no, there's three of them. A light, a medium, and a dark, I believe, are the three that they have. Um, I would say this one actually would work for most people, meaning like uh, MAC uh, 15 through like 35 this would probably work for um, so the medium kind of touches all bases where if you went with the lighter one you wouldn't be able to use as many I would think um, because they're so many so much lighter and the same thing with the dark ones is I feel as if um, unless you are a darker skin tone person anyway if you're an african-american skin tone that would work for you but I think um, in most cases, if you have a similar skin to, tone to mine, and even if you have a darker skin tone, this darker color, but see, yeah, then you're going to have a whole set and just need one color again. So maybe the darker one has more colors and same thing with the lighter one. So um, this is the only one I own though. But I definitely would repurchase this. Um, I think it's a quick, easy thing to throw in your bag. It seals really nicely. If you heard that snap, it uh, 
it seals really well. It's not like anything that's going to flip open easily. I have a couple of little concealer wheels that open up fairly easily. Um, but I really like this. I think it's a great product. I think uh, they definitely hit the nail on the head with this one. Um, I think this was sent to me. Sorry, I can't remember because I buy some stuff from Coastal Sense and then they sent me some things. I think this was sent to me though think so. I'd have to look back in my hauls. I'll double check. Um, but this is one that um, I'll purchase another one of. Um, so I definitely like this. Um, if you have any additional questions on this, just post them below and uh, I'll put Coastal Sense link to the side over here. Um, if you're interested, you can definitely check them out. They've got some cool stuff. But um, this by far, of all the things I've tried of theirs, I think is my favorite so far. Definitely a winner for me. So um, I hope you found this review helpful. If you have any additional questions, just post them below and I'll get back to you soon as I can. Thanks so much for watching guys and have a great day. Bye!